Today is a marvelous Monday, February 22nd. We had a great weekend and are ready to take on this last week of February. We packed a lot of things into this short month and it went by fast. Yes, sometimes it is good to slow down and be mindful. Let's have Mrs. Keen help us to slow down and start our day right with a mindful Monday. Hey Patriots, this is Mrs. Keen with Mindful Monday. And we've been talking about how we can use our mindfulness to calm our brain, to flip this lid back on our emotional brain when our amygdala takes over um, so that we can get our thinking brain back on. Well, today I want to take a different approach to it. And I want to talk to you about when your body wants to move, but you're really not supposed to be moving. So this is when we're feeling wiggly and fidgety, um, but we're supposed to be sitting down, uh, taking a test, um, doing some classwork, and our body can't seem to calm down. So in this exercise, it is called being a pretzel, and that's because we are going to cross our arms and our legs as a way to kind of hug our body in tight so that we can try to relax all that nervous energy that we have. So I have a friend who is going to show us how to do it. Okay, so this is Ella. Hi, Ella. Thank you for being my helper. And, oh, Ella's gonna show us how to be a pretzel. So Ella, you're going to first hold out your arms in front of you and face your palms away from. There you go. So you look like a little seal. Ar, ar, ar. And then you're going to cross your arms. You're going to cross your arms over. There you go. And interlace your fingers. And then you're going to flip your arms in. Boop. Just like that. And tuck it under your chin. And so you've got your top half of your body in a pretzel, and now you're going to cross your legs. There you go. So she's got her legs crossed and her arms crossed. And now she's going to take a good deep breath, and she's going to squeeze everything like a big hug. So breathe in deep. And then breathe out and relax. Breathe in deep. Squeeze. And out. Breathe in deep, squeeze, and then out, and relax. And breathe in deep, and out, and relax. One more time, breathe in, and breathe out. You can uncurl your arms and your feet. And how are you feeling, Ella? She said she's feeling good. Okay, thank you. Thanks, Mrs. Keen. Now we are ready to start the day. Another great way to start the day is to talk about birthdays. Yay! Happy birthday to Lily R. in Miss Rosado's class over the weekend. Happy birthday to Samantha G and Mrs. Myers' class and Kendall M and Mrs. Govin's class. Happy birthday! Today is also George Washington's birthday. Here are some interesting facts about our first president. Did you know Washington is the only president to have a state named for him? Did you know George Washington is the only president that did not live in the White House? Did you know George Washington wrote about 20,000 letters in his lifetime? It would take 50 to 55 years to write that many letters if he wrote one letter per day. Did you know he does not have a middle name? Just first name George, last name Washington. That's it. Did you know George Washington is the only president who went into battle while he was president? Washington ruined his teeth crackling open walnuts. He had to wear fake teeth that were made from lots of different things. You won't see many pictures of him smiling because his fake teeth were so uncomfortable. 
Well, that's another good reason to take care of your teeth, Patriots. Hmm, teeth makes me think of chewing. Chewing makes me think of lunch. What are we having for lunch today? Today for lunch we are having PB&J sandwich, cheese snack combo, or tangerine chicken with chow mein noodles. Best one fruit choices are cucumber dippers, garlic roasted broccoli, a fresh orange, peach cup, or juice. Well, that wraps up the new show for today, Patriots. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Mighty Mindful Monday, Patriots. And remember, we are living the questions. In person and virtually. Bye. Bye.